Today we're gonna talk about the KW10 watch. It comes in a box like this. Uh, let's take a look inside. So this one is, you have to put the strap on. So this is the interface. It's nice color, very shiny. And it comes separately with a manual. Um, let's see, maybe it's in different languages. So I do see Chinese and um, English. And it comes with a strap which comes separately. And you have to hook it up yourself. There you go. Let me see what's there on this side. Oh, on this side is the charger. So, so there are three pins that comes with it. There you go. It looks like this. One, that's, and two for the two sides, and this is to adjust. So you're gonna see over here that on the band you have this and a slit over here. So that knob needs to fit in this slit. So we're gonna put that pin inside here to fit in that slit. Okay, and there's a little spring inside. So we're gonna put one side and then press on that knob to bring down the needle and release it. Okay, we're gonna try the other side too now. So here, the knob is here, it has to go inside here, so you put in the long, longer side first so that the knob goes inside. Stick it out here. Then this will hold on. Then we just put that in here. Put that side inside here. Push the knob down. And oops. it's not that easy with my nail, but let's try again here. And it just clicks in. And this side is adjustable for my size hand, so I'm not gonna adjust the I'm not gonna adjust this side now, but you can use this in the booklet to adjust this size. It shows you right here how to adjust that. Um, so the functions, you, you turn on the, by holding down, you turn on the phone and you click on the bottom side here to show you all the applications. It's pretty standard with the pedometer, with the heart rate monitor, with the map, um, the calorie count, and the workout session. And the workout here, you can choose on this phone, on this watch, uh, if you're running or doing other activity like hiking, brisk walking, climbing, cycling. So it gives you adjusted calories and adjusted step count for each. Um, and then you go to, you get, um, some um, sleep details and that's about it. So the phone, you can connect it to your phone via Bluetooth. And the app that we use in this watch is called the Link to Health. I'm trying to see if there's a code, but there's also a code on this side to on the box to connect it so once you turn it on then it's pretty standard like other smart watches you can get call notification um, message notification even through uh, apps like whatsapp or uh, wechat um, you can set up your alarm you have a sedentary reminder so if you don't want to be sitting for too long it just gives you a reminder when to get up and and, and walk around medication reminder which is very important for um, our community nowadays so it gives you up to times you can set up to take your medication um, and then you have the find device um, uh, option and the um, software update so I'm gonna put it down here and show you um, how we can call from a phone and um, stick it 
still get the notification. So let's try the call first. There you go. So I'm gonna be calling this phone, which is connected to the watch. And you see it over here on the phone. And now I'm going to send a message also. Um, just a random message. To the same phone that's connected to the watch. And you can get the notification once it receives it. And if you send direct messages, usually you can read the message, but some apps, um, they can give you the notification, but not actually read the message. So it depends which country you're in and what app you're using, but it varies. So this is a very sleek, um, elegant um, watch that looks very pretty. I hope you enjoy the